Hello my YouTube family. Yes, I am in my car and no, it doesn't look like my battery is going to last long. So hopefully this is going to work. I'm heading to TJ Maxx to see what I can find today. I've been catching a couple of videos that show that there's the Marc Jacobs collection, the cherry collection, which I am very interested in checking out. I'm just waiting for my car to uh, get rid of the ice. Let, let me show you. Yeah, that's my windshield. <laughs> uh, I have to wait for the defrosters to do their job before I even attempt to try to chip that off. So this is going to be interesting. But I may have to go in and charge my camera for a little bit before I leave because I really want to do this. I keep saying that I want to and then I get afraid to go in and vlog. I need to get over that. So we're going to see what happens. I got a new mask. Let's see how it fits fits well and it's really cute. I got it from New York and Company because I ordered a pair of jeans from them and only one of them fit. So I <laughs> got to make that trip to the store too. Let me go get my camera charged, let my car defrost, and I will see you soon in the store. So we got this Moda set here. It's really pretty. I don't remember seeing this one advertised. It's called Mythical. This one's on sale for $9.99, which is not a bad price for a set. Of course, you know I have tons of brushes already. There's one little Sigma brush sitting here. Not one that I need, but let's see what they're charging for. This one is $12.99. Of course, I'm going to look up all the prices for you guys. I don't think it's a bad price, though. I've never seen Laura Mercier brushes here before. It's also $12.99. This is what they're showing you what it looks like. It says a cheek and contour brush. They've got two pieces hanging out. It says the Essential Set 2.0. It looks like it has a powder brush, one eyeshadow brush, and it looks like a flat foundation. And this one's only $5.99. Bunch more Moda Pro brush sets here. We've got this one. We have another pretty glittery, sparkly one. This one's called the Glitter Bomb. Black one is $7.99. And the glitter bomb set is $9.99. I just found some new Japanese brushes. I have a couple of them and I've liked them. This one was really interesting. They call it an eye highlight brush. It's going to be great for my brow bone. I have some similar ones from BH Cosmetics. And it's only $3.99, so I think I'm going to be picking this one up. They also have a whole bunch here. Some shaders, a pencil brush. They have a whole bunch of Stridectin products. You know that I really like their neck cream concentrate. This is $19.99. I still think it's worth it. I did find it on clearance that one day for $14, but it's still worth the $19.99. This is also one of my favorite products. I still have a full one left that I had bought in TJ Maxx. It is their intensive concentrate for wrinkles and stretch marks. It doesn't work for stretch marks, but it sure does work for wrinkles. And this one is also $19.99, a really, really good price. I also have a lot of Shiseido products, but you know that I do not like the ingredients in the Shiseido because they have a lot of denatured alcohol. But if you guys are interested, they do have it here. And I'm sure it's discounted. This is also $19.99, which is really discounted for them. But again, not a fan. They have a few scattered pieces of the First Day Beauty. They just kind of scatter all over the place. This one is their eye cream. I don't know if I've ever tried their eye cream. I have tons of eye creams at the moment. But this one is $14.99. Okay, it looks like they have some pretty good stuff here. Found a Profusion palette. Did I buy one the last time? I don't remember, but this one's called Royal Eyes. I've heard so many good things about Profusion. This one's only $5.99. Let's see if I can take a look. That looks like a very pretty palette. I mean, it's so neutral on the top, though, and then you just have that really beautiful row of those blues and the greens. I think it has too many colors that I already have. I'm hoping maybe I can find a smaller palette that might interest me more. I did also find the Too Faced Natural Lust palette. I've seen a couple of pieces before. It wasn't one that really interested me into getting it, but let's see what the price is. This one is $29.99 and there's a color story on the back. I'm not going to open up because I only open up things that I think I might purchase. Here's a really interesting brows kit from Profusion. It's in a squishy black case, which is really nice. This little guy is $7.99. Let's see if I can see what is in it. This is really, really nice. It's got a nice mirror in it. It has a whole bunch of different shades of brow products. It comes with eye stencils, tweezers, could be mascara or brow setter, and several different brushes. It's like a really, really cool kit. They also have some Profusion contour and blush kits. This one is only 
I just saw this hiding out on the shelf. This is the Runway Spring 2020 Marc Jacobs collection. It's $14.99. It looks like it comes with like one of their highlighter drops, a pencil, what looks to be like a purpley color. And one of the products that I can't see because I don't have my glasses on. I also have a bunch of the Pretty Vulgar Early Bird palettes. I'm going to have to look this one up online and see what the color story is. It is only $9.99. So I did find just a few pieces of some Laura Mercier sitting here. This is $14.99 and is their Flawless Fusion Ultra Wear Foundation. I don't think I've ever tried this. It's in the color Butterscotch. I would have to look it up to find the shade. Then here is the uh, Silk Cream Foundation, oil free. This one's $9.99. I'm thinking this might be a stick. It's in the color Dune. They also have their foundation primer, which is $9.99. One little touch and soul no, no problem primer. I do have this. I didn't like it at first, but I do actually like it now. It is $9.99. There are a couple of the Becca Holiday kits hanging out here. These are three of the little saucers. It is $12.99. Let's see what colors we get. I'm getting champagne pop, vanilla quartz, and one that I can't read. And then there's this other little one sitting here. It looks like it comes with one. It's a value of $41. It used to be $27.99. So have here the Revolution Color Book. This is the purple one. This is CB04. I bought the green one, and to be honest, I haven't even used it really. They have this one for $29.99. That is not a price I would pay for Makeup Revolution. On the Laura Mercier, the Nudes palette. That's what it looks like. They also have this for $29.99, which I also think is pretty high. I also found this Kiko Milano Eyes and Face Palette. It doesn't show what it looks like, but it's $4.99. I'll have to look it up. We found this little Becca set called Put a Glow on it, and it looks like it comes with the highlighter is the Skin Love and the Glow Primer, and this one is $9.99. Three of these Milani highlighters in three different colors. They're only $2.99. So found two Zoeva palettes. They are the Spice of Life. I've never seen the baby. I have the full size one. And this one is $3.99. There's just two of them sitting here. I also found three of the Rachel Zoe and Lorac Hollywood Glamour Mini Palettes. I have one of these and it's one of my favorite palettes. It's only $4.99. I'm going to look and see if it is in good condition. It is in perfect condition, so I am going to be getting it. The bunch of the Maybelline Vivid Liquid Matte Shadows. They have Nude Frill, Nude Flush, Rebel Red, and all of them are $2.99. I found a couple of the Urban Decay Velvetizer Baby Powders. I really do love this powder. I don't use it to mix in with my foundation, but I do use it as setting powder. And they are only $3.99 if I didn't have so many powders. I would pick this one up. Little Baby NARS kit hanging out back there. It looks like a mini probably of the blush that I don't like the name. And a Little Baby Lip Gloss. It's $12.99. A bunch of, well not a bunch, they have four of the milk foundations, the blur liquid, they're all in deep colors. We have coffee and deep and that looks like all that they have. They are $9.99. There's even a concealer hanging out back here. It's in another deep color. Concealer is only $7.99. I also found of the some of the Cover FX Custom Enhancer Drops. We have Halo, which I have. We have Blossom. They are $9.99 each. I don't use them that often. There are a bunch of the Milk Makeup Push Lip Balms. All of the packages are really beat up. They're only $5.99. Looks like they have Canatonic, Golden Sand, Herb. They have Nug. They have cute little sets here from Burt's Bees. I haven't seen Burt's Bees in a while. It is their body lotion and a strawberry lip balm. These are $3.99. I think they were probably from Christmas. They have the regular. This is just in the beeswax for the same price. I also found two pieces of the Buxom sets. It looks like a large and a small. It says $32. It was originally for on sale for $15. It's in Sandy and Claire. And it's $9.99. 
There's some Mark Jacobs products hanging out here. Let's see what we've got. There's Moonstone and it's their sequins. I'm thinking, oh, that these are their liquid eyeshadows. It's on clearance for $6. But again, I don't know if anybody's messed with it. I try not to buy liquid lipsticks or anything that you can take the wand down and somebody maybe touch. This is the Accomplice Concealer that I wound up putting back a couple of times back. I may pick it up if it's the right color because I have heard good things about it. It's $9.99. It's in the color medium. If no one's touched it, I may give it a go. There's also a bunch of the Lime Crime. So they're lip toppers. They're $5.99. We have Cleopatra. Got over the rainbow. I tried these once, but I did find them a little bit uh, gritty, which is why I didn't use it too much. I was looking for these the last time that I was here. These are the Brow Pro from Benefit, the ones that look like the pens. $9.99. This one's in deep. I'm hoping that they're gonna have another color. They only have deep and light. It's gonna be a good color for me. It does say brown black, but we're gonna try. It's also clear on style for $8. I wanna make sure that it's still untouched. I did find one piece of the Kush Milk Makeup with liner. It's $7.99. It's in the color Loud, which I'm thinking might be black. I'm gonna check it out and see if it is in good condition. It doesn't look like it's been opened, so it might be good. Oh, this is the Discontinued Physicians Formula, the Healthy Foundation that I absolutely loved. I just finished up a bottle. Color looks way too dark for me, but it's only $3.99. Let me see if they have any colors I can use. Why do they always discontinue the color, the foundations that we like? I found some Becca foundation, the ultimate coverage. This one is in linen, and it's only $9.99. So they have a bunch of mixed chicks products here. I've heard some pretty good things about them. I might have even tried one at one point, but this is the Pearl Defying Leave-In Conditioner. It's only $3.99. I'm tempted to, to try it, but I have so many hair products at the moment. The Daily Hair Dress, and it's $5.99. I do have a straightening serum, which I actually may try. Thermal protectant for heat styling. It's $7.99. It's a really nice Cantu set. I have a big thing of this shea butter that I really like. This one comes with a pick, which is great for my hair. Comes with the Clarify and Renew hair and scalp massage it's called the winter clarify and curl and it's $7.99 that's not bad at all look they have one piece of the ABH loose glitter set that I probably picked up for I think 20 yep and it is on clearance for $16 I still haven't played with it but I really want to I think I'm gonna like it I also see one little piece of the Kate Somerville derma quench liquid lift is clearance down for $39, but I'm pretty sure it's probably over $100. Oh, scrunchies, why am I so addicted to you? For $5.99. They're really soft. This one is velvet. I may pick them up. Never have too much scrunchies. I just found some makeup remover wipes. This is watermelon. <laughs> you know I was interested in that. You get 60 wipes. They say detoxifying. And it is on clearance for $3. That means it's coming home with me. Some bigger ones. These I actually like very much. I like things like for lips, liquid lipsticks that you can just lay them out across because when you stack them in a toilet drawer, they just get lost. So this one's pretty nice. This one's a little up there. It is $16.99, but I'm thinking about it. Here's a cute little one. It has two stand-up compartments with two drawers and a recessed top over here that you can put stuff on top. And this one is $12.99. Yes, yes, I do have a pajama obsession. These are so freaking soft. Oh, they're from Ray Dunn, and they're $20. They have cute little camo with a gathered ankle. And literally, I can't believe how soft they are. I have to decide. They have them a cute little gray color, too. I don't need more pajamas. Okay, they have so many candles here that I wouldn't even know where to begin. But they have this one called Vanilla Oud. It's $12.99 and I really, really like the way it smells, so I'm going to pick this one up for sure. I had walked away uh, from the section and then I came back, and when I came back, there are two of the Becca palettes. The Barbie Ferrara palettes, the highlighting ones, it just didn't interest me when I saw it, and it's uh, $14.99. I also found two Morphe palettes when I came back. This is the Desi Danger 
some reason I don't even remember this release. It is $6.99. I'm going to try to look up the color story. So I'm walking back to my car. I did a little bit of damage. Well, really loud. I'm in a parking garage. They didn't have too much stuff. I was really disappointed not to see the Marc Jacobs. I don't know if I have the wherewithal to go to another store today. We'll see. Back at my car. Hey guys, I am at my second store now. I'm running out of steam rather quickly, so I'm going to see how much footage I can get, and hopefully there will be more makeup in this one. Let's still keep our paws crossed for the Marc Jacobs stuff. See you in a bit. Hey guys, so I walked in and the first thing, of course, that I noticed is the Marc Jacobs kit that I saw last time called Blurred and Bronzed. It has the bronzer. I don't know what the other product is, but I know it also has the primer as well, a little mini. It's $29.99. I'm still debating it. I'm really not sure, but I'm going to think about it. But they have quite a few pieces up here. So they also, again, have that Runway Spring collection. We also have the Marc Jacobs set of highlighters. It's called Do Everything. This is not something I would get personally. It's only $14.99. They have the Mini Shake Your Pom Poms palette from Too Faced. This is $14.99. But that's a really cool find. I haven't seen this before. So we have this NARS set. It is originally $24. It looks like it has the mascara mini eye trio it has an eyeliner and it looks like that might be the lash primer as well and it is basically half price it's $12.99 they have a whole section of these Stila palettes here for $19.99 so the after hours palette I don't remember what it looks like I'm going to have to look it up online as well this one I might be interested in getting I will take a look found a couple of NARS palettes here I don't know what they are yet this is the Hustle Cheek Palette. I think this is their Studio 54. It is on the back. Those look beautiful. And it's $25. Oh, I'm on the fence about whether or not I want to get it. It does look really, really pretty, though. They have some Laura Mercier Mineral Finishing Powder. This is one that I haven't tried before. This is only $12.99. I love the Laura Mercier Powder we got in one of our boxes. They have this little It Cosmetics Confidence in a Gel Lotion and the CC Plus Cream. It was originally $18 and it is $12.99. I don't know how much of a good deal that one is. Well, they have the Bronze Goddess Palette here from Estee Lauder. This is an 01 Light and it is $19.99. I think I'm going to pick this one up. Then they have this adorable little Yui kit way it's rose gold it looks like I don't know whether the palette scratched up in there or not but it is their powder highlighter and it has a long wear lip cream and a long wear lip topper it's the rose gold deluxe collection and that's what the highlighter looks like this is only $5.99 also the little white lies highlighting palette from Stila it's only at $12.99 then I saw this cute little set here another one from Stila it has their, it's called I Dare You, two of the Glitter and Glow shadows and an eyeliner. And it's $12.99. Oh, this is really cute. Haven't seen this. It is from MAC. It's their Prep and Prime Fixing Spray and the Strobe Cream. It looks like it is in a pink. This looks like it could have been from Holiday. And it's only $14.99. Also have a bunch of the Bare Minerals original powder foundation it says it's $48 with a $72 value it is in their special packaging it's huge they have fair 01 medium medium beige they have light they have a lot of good colors and this is $17.99 that's a really really good price for it so found some of these julep lip products it is their it's everything lipstick this is in the color get a move on I think I tried this once and I really did enjoy it it's only $2.99, which is a great price. There's three of them all in the same shade. 
when I found this julep palette, Flights of Fancy Solstice Eye and Cheek Palette. It's $4.99. This is what the inside looks like. It's very, I don't know, kind of bland and basic, but it does have the two highlighters as well. Becca Hydra Set and Mist Powders, selling it only for $9.99. They also have the Face Illuminator that we just got in our box from Laura Mercier. This is in Addiction, and it's $14.99. I know originally I think this is $40 something dollars. Also found a Laura Mercier Baked Blush Bronze. It's a blush compact and it says bronze. I don't know what that means, I'm gonna have to look it up. But it is $14.99. The Essential Face Palette. This one is in 02, and this one happens to be $5.99. They also have it in 03. I also found some of the Becca blushes. The Luminous Blush, this one is in Dahlia, and it is $7.99. Oh, I've been wanting to try these. The Bare Minerals Bounce and Blur Blushes. This one is in Pink Sky. These are $7.99. They also have Mauve Sunrise. Also found some Bobbi Brown products. They have a blush here in Tawny 2. This little guy is $12.99. I also found some Bobbi Brown bronzing powders. This one is in Deep 4 for $16.99. Highlighting powder in Pink Glow for $16.99. They have a bunch of pure products here. They have the Shake and Bake powder to cream concealer, which just seems so odd to me. This is in Light and it's $5.99. Maybe I'll pick it up to try something new, I'm not sure. They also have the Dry Oil Elixir, Precious Metals, $4.99. They have the Dry Body Oil from Pure. This had a price tag originally of $28. This is also only $5.99. I also found the Milk Vegan Cleanser. I have not tried this. I've heard good things about it. Only $5.99. There's already an open package, so I can show you what it looks like. Okay, still no Marc Jacobs, but I did find the Becca Dream Sickle Highlighters. It's that orangey color. I have it for only $9.99. Here's the Smashbox Halo, the Healthy Glow Tinted Moisturizer. I've never tried this. I found one in Fair, and it looks like those are all the colors that they have. It is $14.99. Fair is going to be too light for me. Here's the Smashbox, the Hood Witch Crystallized. This is the Priming Water. I just finished up all of my Priming Waters. Lavender and Sweet Orange, and this is actually $17.99, which is a lot. We have a bunch of the Bare Minerals Gen Nude Lip Glosses. This one is in Buttercream, which just sounds amazing. We also have the Plumping Lip Gloss over here. These are $4.99. And these are $4.99 also. It's cute. I haven't seen this. This is the Elf Day Tonight Lipstick Duo in the best berries and it's $2.99. On climate is their lip glaze it says butter and glaze. It says infused with cannabis sativa oil, a rose mary, and it's $5.99. Custom color drops. Oh these are the foundation mixers. I don't think they're glittery. This one is in fair. It's $6.99. There is one in light and it doesn't look like it has been messed with. So I think I'm going to pick this one up. I have a bunch of the Redken products. They have the Diamond Oil Glow Dry the Detangling Conditioner, which I have used and I really like. It's just such a huge bottle and I don't wash my hair that often. It is $20, but definitely worth it because I think this is like at least 50. They have the Color Extend Brown Lights if you have brown hair. The blondage if you have blonde hair. Have the color extend gradient and the extreme length. I found some Pacifica products here. Also some Saint Tropez. This is the gradual tan tinted. I've used this before and I like it. It's only $12.99. The Pacifica they have the body scrub. These always smell so good. This is sunflower, vanilla, and lemon. Yum. And this one's $4.99. They have the Shimmer Lotion. 